Bedford County employees can now bring guns to work if they have a concealed carry permit. And the Board of Supervisors voted unanimously to uh, take the restriction out of the employee handbook. WSOS 10's Anand Ruchita has more from employees who tell us why they say they need the extra protection. As a treasurer for Bedford County, Rebecca Jones deals with a lot of people and their money. Taxes, having to pay taxes, there are angry people weekly. And if someone snapped, she says there wasn't a way to fight back. In here, we have panic button, and that's it. However, after a board of supervisors meeting Monday, Jones has a way to protect herself. The board voted to allow employees to carry concealed weapons if they have a valid Virginia permit. County Attorney Patrick Skelly says it was previously a restriction in the employee handbook that's now taken out. The public has no prohibition, and it would be actually illegal for the county to prohibit the public from um, exercising their Second Amendment rights on county properties. The county attorney told me he will not keep track of how many people will have their concealed carry permit. He told me it's up to them whether or not they choose to carry on the job. In addition, the county attorney took a look at possible issues before the meeting Monday night. He said the county's insurance premiums will not be affected and liability issues could happen with or without a restriction. Jones says she's now bringing her gun to work and wants to train her staff members to defend themselves too. I don't ever intend to use it, but if I had to, to protect myself, I, you know, I would. Other nearby localities allow their employees to carry concealed weapons, including Lynchburg City and Campbell County. In Bedford County, Ananda Rochita, WSLS 10.